when we grow through what is happening in our lives, we become like that uh, seed that is sprouting, that is sprouting up, and that the beauty of it is all of it and not part of it. We become the rose, but we're not just the rose. We're actually the rose and, and, and the vines of the rose and even the thorns. Because if there weren't thorns in the rose, the rose couldn't become a rose. It's all part of one package. I want you to know you can stand in your power because there is a presence within you, that presence of God, that presence of the divine one, because we are created in the image and likeness of God. And that's just the way it is. So stand in your power, letting nothing hold you back. Stand in your power, knowing this too shall pass. Stand in your power, changing your thoughts. Stand in your power by embracing new thoughts. Stand in your power with determination. Stand in your power by surrendering all. Stand in your power with spiritual wisdom that is within you. Just stand. Just stand. Just stand. And when each of us realize and recognize there's the Spirit of God within us, that that gives us divine power. We can stand boldly in this power like Mariana with her pajamas with big black polka dots. We can stand in our power like Dr. Maya Angelou. We can stand in our power like Jesus. All we have to do is stand. Now I have an affirmation. I'm going to say it once and then invite you to say it with me. Here it goes. I am a powerhouse filled with possibility. Let's say that together. Okay, you guys are with it already. Let's say it again together. I am a powerhouse filled with possibility. Put some life in it. Let's say it again. I am a powerhouse filled with possibility. Mm -hmm.